Hi, welcome back to How to Be a Working Comic. I'm Dave Schwenson and I'm author of the book, How to Be a Working Comic. And um, things look a little bit different here because I am set up to do a online comedy workshop. So um, there's no green screen behind me, just furniture, but I'm, I'm wearing a green shirt if that makes you feel better. And uh, yes, and I am standing up because when I do these workshops, I stand up because I think it's all about the energy. I mean, you stand up if you're able. You stand up when you do stand-up comedy, correct? Are you kidding me? All right, and I know things are, are a little bit different because I am using a couple different cameras here. But I am checking my emails. You've got mail. And I received an email from a comedian who was actually in tonight's online comedy workshop. It says, I would appreciate your help in how I can start searching for Googling contacting comedy clubs, organizations, companies with events planned who are looking for speakers and or clean comedians? Yeah, it's a very good question. Wow, that's, that's a great question. Especially if you're in the industry, a performer, you don't have an agent working for you or a manager. You have to do it yourself. And it can be a real dilemma. How do you find these contact people who can hire you for gigs, whether it be comedy clubs, whether it be colleges, corporate events, you know, I'm going to give you a little history lesson real quick. It was easier for us in the old days. We used to have a book called Comedy USA Guide. Yeah, some of the old timers, like me, that's a joke. I don't hear you laughing. That's so funny, I forgot to laugh. <laughs> anyway, there was something called Comedy USA Guide. I don't have a copy of it. It's been too many years since it came out. But it was basically a loose leaf notebook, something like this you received, with uh, all the information in there about comedy clubs, who was booking, who were the event planners for corporate events, who were the college agents, cruise ships. It was all in there. It was all listed, who the person was, how to contact them, their phone number, address, and you would just start making calls. That's what all the comedians and performers will do. Well, since the Internet came along, and put them out of business. And, uh, but my friend here, the comedian tonight, answered his own question, Googling. You've got to play detective. Whether you're a comedian or whether you're a speaker, you've got to play detective. Go online. Start uh, Googling, looking for comedy clubs maybe in your area. Who schedules that? Call up. There'll be a phone number. All right? Event planners. Call up. Look for them. What events? What are conferences are coming up in your area? Do a little search on the internet. Make those calls. Yeah, they're cold calls, and nobody likes making cold calls, but after a while, you might get used to it. I'll tell you what, the, the people who are big agents now that work for the big agencies, that's how they started out. They had to make those calls and start getting bookings for their clients, and it's what you need to do also. All right, listen, I'm going to leave you with that because I do have an online workshop starting in a few minutes where my friend is going to be joining us along with a few other people. So I'm going to sign off. Uh, be sure to subscribe to this channel, by the way. You see a little button there? Hit that button because I want to know if these videos are helpful for you. And I'll only know if you subscribe. My name is Dave Schwenson. This has been called How to Be a Working Comic. And until we meet again, keep laughing. <laughs>